Happy Easter holidays. Hi and welcome to The Property Show, the best in the world of real estate on this side of the savannah. Are you looking to venture into this sector with absolutely low risks and high returns? This show is for you. Securing a fast home is probably the biggest long-term financial decision one makes in life. It's important to know what one is getting involved with to avoid costly mistakes and overcommitting yourself financially. Catch a conversation on how to navigate this complex topic later on the show. So what makes a good payment plan? It should strike a balance between affordability, flexibility, and risk management. Look for plans that align with your financial situation, offer reasonable timelines and installment amounts, and provide clear terms and conditions. On the property pick of the week basket, our focus is highlighting flexible payment and budget-friendly projects the best options available in the market. Another catchy segment is our decorating corner, unveiling the transformative magic of our iFundi home services. The work was done within the given timelines with transparency without interrupting our client's daily activities. The client inspected the work and took it from me, wowed. By the outcome, she assured to spread the news of our great works to all her friends. The property news segment shines a spotlight on our signature bus tour, the first step towards climbing the property ladder. Stay tuned for more details. Our favorite home ownership segment shares a story on the number one box to tick when buying a home, saving, 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 and being consistent. Believe me, my brother, if in this country, if you have a job, it's not enough. You must belong to a financial institution where you can save fast before you do other things in life. Let's connect on our digital platforms and for exclusive weekly property updates, hit the subscription button on our YouTube channel. Our diaspora desk is open for a chat and is one telephone call away. The journey to owning a home begins right here and our commitment is your peace of mind. Sit back and enjoy a fully packed, exciting and informative episode. As always, there is something for everyone. Next, the property pick of the week. We've selected flexible payment investment opportunities with absolutely low risk and high return options. An excellent bet for both home buyers as well as investors. Our first project is conveniently located in a family-friendly neighborhood along Thika Superhighway. Highway. 
14 minutes drive from the city center with easy access to Jomo Kenyatta International Airport through the Outer Ring Road. With exceptionally built quality and top of the range finishes, this project comes with beautifully designed one and two bedroom duplexes and three bedroom apartments. The project is ideal for home buyers as well as investors seeking a mix of high yield, affordability and quality development. The main highlights include gross yields of 13% and an already realized capital appreciation of 11%. The project is located at an arm's reach away from access to all amenities ideal for a modern family. The cherry on top is the flexible payment plan of installments spread over 24 months. Let's dive in. Located within an already established 47-acre mixed-use development along Thicker Road, this project consists of one- and two-bedroom luxurious duplex units and beautifully designed three-bedroom apartments. The residences will have access to 100 shops and restaurants, premium entertainment hubs, and access to commercial, financial, health, and retail facilities. With a diversified mix of amenities that speak to all demographics, some of the unique amenities include a spacious lounge area opening to a dining area, a kitchen fitted with top and bottom cabinets, a master ensuite bedroom, a common cloakroom, Dolby area, and a servant quarter. Other shared amenities include a perimeter wall with electric fence, cabro paved driveways, botanical garden, kids play area, high-speed lifts, commercial-scale gym, a swimming pool, a clubhouse and barbecue deck, a private 300-meter jogging track, one acre of planned green space. Our second project is a stunning two, three and four bedroom apartment strategically located along Langata Road. This project brags of flexible payment plan on rent to own payment scheme, a model that allows you to pay a percentage of the purchase price, followed by a monthly rental payments for a period of 15 years. What makes this project special? All amenities are within the premises, including a mall. Currently, they have a limited number of units still available for sale. And guess what? We can arrange private viewing to help you pick a deal. Located along Langata Road near Wilson Airport. This development comprises of nine blocks of 252 units that consist of two, three, and four bedroom apartments. The units sit on a plinth area of 101, 128, and 153 square meters, respectively. Accommodation features include spacious lounge area with a large bay window spacious dining area, kitchen with top and bottom cabinets offering enough storage, common cloakroom, master ensuite bedroom, laundry area, 
prepaid gas system and intercom. Other amenities include 24-7 manned gate with a perimeter wall, electric fence and CCTV cameras, ample parking, carbro paved driveways, landscaped gardens, safe and secure children's play area, fire alarm system, modern lifts, backup generators, solar water heating system, boho, water purification plant and a biodigester. This development has its own mall where residents can do their shopping and can also get banking services. Next, well-appointed apartments located along Waiyaki Way with easy access to the CBD and other commercial hubs. This project comes with one, two and three bedroom apartments. Only a few three bedroom units are available for sale. This project has a return on investment of 8%. Let's find out more. Modern, luxurious and masterfully designed affordable apartments, 28 units of one, two and three bedroomed apartments are ideal to suit every family size. The accommodation features include a spacious lounge area with a sliding door leading to a balcony, a separate dining area, a fully fitted kitchen with designer cabinetry, a separate pantry and laundry area, a visitor's cloakroom and an ensuite master bedroom with built in ceiling height designer wardrobes. Shared common amenities will include 24 hour man security access, a perimeter fence with CCTV surveillance, ample parking space with cabro paved driveways, children play area, ample water supply, backup generator, high speed lifts, well equipped gym facility a rooftop pool area, a lounge area with spectacular and breathtaking views of Mountain View suburbs. This development has an easy access to Westlands, CBD, Gigiri and Lavington with great schools and shopping facilities around, thus defines the perfect lifestyle living. At the property show and fast avenue we work with tried tested and trusted developers with a proven track record of successfully delivering projects within set timelines on the other hand we have a large portfolio of properties in every price range Whether you're in the diaspora or right here, our professional team will hold your hand throughout the entire property ownership journey. Just drop us an email, give us a call, or even better, visit our offices and we'll be happy to find you the right home.
The journey to owning a home begins right here on The Property Show. Our commitment is your peace of mind. Real estate is a proven investment with high returns and low risks. Insights on owning a home with flexible payment plans with our First Avenue team. Let's listen in. Buying a home is a huge milestone, especially for first-time buyers. That's where flexible payment plans come in. They create an easy entry into home ownership and make housing more accessible. Today, we dive deep into these options. We will walk you through what flexible payment plans entail, the different types available, and how we at First Avenue can be a trusted guide throughout the entire process. So picture this. Instead of scrambling to come up with a hefty lump sum, these plans let you spread out these costs into bit-sized chunks that fit your financial capability. The most popular options are payment plans offered during the construction period of a development and those offered on completed developments, under which we have the rent-to-own option. Let me explain each one briefly. The construction period payment plan. This plan is designed for off-plan buyers with the ability to pay an initial deposit of between 10 to 20% of the property's purchase price. The remaining amount is paid in installments during the construction period. Each installment is due upon completion of a specific construction stage or upon the agreed time. So what should you consider? One, thoroughly review the construction timeline and payment schedules to ensure they align with your financial capabilities. Assess the developer's track record and reputation for timely project completion. Understand the penalties or interest charges for late or missed payments. And most importantly, ensure you have a contingency fund or plan to cover any unforeseen circumstances. The rent to own plan. Under this plan, you rent the property for a predetermined period of time and pay the rent that contributes towards the eventual purchase price. At the end of the agreed rental term, the property's ownership is then transferred to you. But before you can get into any of this agreement with the developer, first, you need to understand the specific terms, including the rental period, purchase price, and portion of rent credited towards the purchase in cases where interest rates apply. Ensure the purchase price is fair and aligns with the market rates at the end of the rental term. This means you have to assess the future value of the house. Two, assess your ability to finance installments during the agreed upon timelines. In both of these payment plans, make sure you thoroughly review and understand all terms and conditions and fine prints in the payment plan agreement. So make sure to work with a legal expert. Assess your long-term financial capabilities and commitments to ensure you can sustain the payment plan. Seek professional advice from a financial advisor or real estate consultant to evaluate the payment plan suitability for your circumstances. Be wary of unrealistic and overly attractive payment plans that may be too good to be true. Prioritize reputable developers with a proven track record and transparent practices. So what makes a good payment plan? It should strike a balance between affordability, flexibility, and risk management. Look for plans that align with your financial situation, offer reasonable timelines and installment amounts, and provide clear terms and conditions. Additionally, a good payment plan should be offered with a credible developer with a strong reputation and history for delivering on their commitment. We at First Avenue pride ourselves on offering a consultative approach. We'll sit down with you, listen to your needs and concerns, and tailor a solution that works best for you. Our team has extensive knowledge of not only the various payment plans, but we work with developers who offer these purchasing options, as you may have noticed from our property picks of the week today.
For those of you who may be interested in obtaining a home loan, we'll also connect you with reputable lenders and help you with all the paperwork and negotiations. For those interested in learning more or scheduling a consultation, visit us at International House on the ground floor along Mamangina Street or give us a call. We are happy to guide you every step of the way. Happy house hunting! When you acquire real estate fully paid for under the watch of professionals, it remains one of the most secure investments globally. It's time for a short commercial break, but stick around for what is ahead, unveiling the transformative magic of our iFundi home services. Our upcoming signature bus tour, this time round, it's bigger and better. Tips on conquering home ownership hurdles. Immediately they did part of the house. I started living in one room while I'm making another one. Let's connect on our digital platforms and for exclusive weekly property updates, hit our YouTube channel subscription button. Our diaspora desk is available for a chat and we are just a telephone call away. The journey to owning a home begins right here on The Property Show. Our commitment to you is your peace of mind. Don't go away, we'll be right back after the break. Welcome back. You're watching The Property Show, the best in the world of real estate on this side of the savannah. The second half of the show brings insightful conversations, unveiling the transformative magic of our iFundi home services. Our upcoming signature bus tour, this time round, it's bigger and better. Tips on conquering home ownership hurdles. Let's connect on our digital platforms for exclusive weekly property updates. Hit our YouTube channel subscription button. Our diaspora desk is a telephone call away too. The journey to owning a home begins right here on The Property Show. Our commitment is your peace of mind. Next, the transformative magic of our iFundi home services. Let's see what they have to offer. The Property Show iFundi Home Services is a product of First Avenue that offers comprehensive home services which includes home renovation and repairs, interior decoration, painting services, plumbing services, bathroom and kitchen remodeling, tiling services, flooring services, roofing and ceiling installation, lighting and electrical services. 
Just so you know, residential agreement stipulates that a tenant is supposed to vacate a house in a perfectly habitable condition, which means the tenant has to do all the repairs and renovation that might have been caused by wear and tear while living in the house. This means one must renovate and repair the house to the state at which it was during their occupancy period. Recently, we worked with a tenant who was moving out, which meant she needed to repaint her walls, ceiling, cabinet, doors and windows, and the floors to be renovated. On the call with the client, we agreed the following. First, to visit the site in order to assess and analyze the scope of work to be done. During the site inspection, our technician took measurements of both the floor size, walls, ceiling, cabinet, windows for quotation preparation. Secondly, upon site inspection, we came up with a detailed quotation highlighting materials and labor cost. We then shared the quotations with our client together with our terms and condition and working schedule before executing the work. The client was pleased with the quotations, which she felt was affordable and pocket-friendly. After making payments, we then procured materials and mobilized our professional fundies to site for work to start immediately. Day one and day two, we started with floor sanding, which was to remove floor imperfections improve the look of the wood and prepare the surface for polishing. We then polish the floor to make it hard, durable and give it a permanent shine which was left to dry overnight. As you can see, the floor is now sparkling and brilliant. The flooring works took us only two days to complete. On the third day, we started painting by applying undercoat to prepare the surface, which took only one day. Finally, on the fourth day, we applied two layers of the top coat, which was brilliant white to all the cabinets, windows, doors, ceilings and walls to provide a desired appearance and for aesthetic purpose. Before we left the site, we made sure to clean all the residue and remove the materials and leave the place habitable. And voila, the work was done within the given timelines with transparency without interrupting our client's daily activities. The client inspected the work and took it from me. The client was wowed by the outcome and guess what? She assured to spread the news of our great works to all her friends. Are you looking to renovate or repair your home or workplace? You too could experience this seamless and hassle-free process. All you have to do is to give us a call or visit our offices and we'll be happy to assist you. Remember, our commitment is your peace of mind. There you have it. Are you looking to spruce up your home, decorate, fix a few things, or just need a fundi to add a touch of glam to every corner of your home?
much no more. iFundi Home Services, we work with professionals and fundis with expertise in improving and refurbishing both residential and commercial spaces, guaranteeing a smooth end-to-end -end process. Coming up, a story on the number one box to tick when buying a home. Saving, saving, saving and being consistent. Let's listen in. I am a family man. And being a lawyer, you don't mention the number of kids you have. <laughs> and matters profession, I am a telecommunication engineering specialist, working with one of the leading ISPs in Kenya. And by God's grace, I also sit on the board of Telepost Sako. I grew up in a family that is not so well to do. And every time my mother, and being a, a child from a single motherhood, my mother once in a while would, uh, me and my siblings, would remind us, hey, you normally see a man in this house? Pretty hard, have your own homes. So it kept on ringing in my mind, ringing in my mind and say, one day when I have a job and I have my own means, akimaze, ni kutuna kwangu, iku kumbushua na kupushiwa must come to a reality. So that's how I grew up. And occasionally when I come to college in Nairobi, given that we am um, village bred, we didn't have a home in Nairobi, I could live with relatives here and there. And when you live with relatives, you could see the good and the bad, the ugly and the good. You live with a relative where you open the gate so many times when visitors come and go until you get tired. Or you go in uh, visit a relative somewhere in Eastlands where the lighting of the house is so pathetic until you say, if I have my own house, Mazei kwen enough lighting. So the appetite started growing in me on having a home where I can decide how to live. Yeah. So the real now turning point happened when now finally I got a job. And when I got a job, I realized it was not easy after all to own a home. I bought a, my first car. I was living somewhere in Rongai. And the car I used to park it, the place did not look nice. At some point there was a security threat. So quickly, I talked to an agent that I picked from some newspaper, somewhere in Umojawan, who said there is a two bedroom house. And I moved to that house without having gone to check it. Eh, hey, maze. So because I was in a hurry, there was a security threat, I almost uh, got uh, kajaked on the gate that I was living in Rongai. It prompted the moving fast. So when I went there, a truck loaded with things, with my slick car, you know that first car, the car that you normally give a pronoun, her, she. Yeah, I remember it was a black Toyota Ipsum. It was a lovely car. So I'm falling behind with the truck. Tunafika pale umoja, tunaza ku offload. In my mind, najua hiyo nyumba ilikuwa two bedroom, ni mzuri. Eh, when we reached there, yani kupandisha hata viti. Inapandishwa na muscle men, boys wa mtaa, wanavuta na kamba through the balcony. Kiti moja mbili meza, yenye likuwa na glass, glass isha vunjika. I was traumatized. And you think that was enough? <laughs> When we got in the house now, the corridor is tiny. I think those are the houses that someone buys a, a plot and demolishes the original house and builds a house and wants many units. But the units have small spaces. When we went inside, the two bedroom, the master bedroom could not even fit my bed. That first evening, to Lilala Chin. Chin, because Babu, Kitanda Haikutosha. As if that was not enough, the sitting room, the seats that had been broken, one of the, of the seats, were, we could not even arrange them properly because the space was not enough. So I simply put things on top of the other 
And then I started shopping, or looking around for a house. I was in that house while I was looking for another one. 20 days later, you know, Madam Landlady accounted for my deposit 15,000. Broken cistern, broken door handle, uh, paint. And at some point she told me that my balance is 800 shillings. The kind of money that she was ready to refund me out of my 15,000 deposit. Najua maze. 15,000 of those days, it was not little money. Kuna kauchungu maze, nilisikia kakiteremuka hapa. Then, I told Madam Landlady, thank you. You know what? You are my turning point. You have made me now decide that I must have my own house. Then I shook her hand and told her, Thank you, madam. You have inspired me. Every house I used to live in, Niki Hama, Maze, landlord will always create issues. Lamar, I broke this, I broke that. Until to a level where deposit in a bakiuko. Then I'm like, come on, this is, I'm being mistreated. And at times, you cannot even practice what you love most. Me, I love plants. I cannot grow a flower so that it grows over the balcony the way I want. I love landscaping. I wanted a space of my own where I can do all that. I can even light a bonfire and choma douche pale maze. Nikule tu douche, nime relax na hota moto. In my own space. So I started fantasizing. Finally, when I got a well-paying job, I enrolled into membership of a circle. Believe me, my brother, if in this country, if you have a job, it's not enough. You must belong to a financial institution where you can save fast before you do other things in life. That's the only way you will save. So when I enrolled to a circle, I saved slowly and then I took a loan. And this space you are in, I bought it with cash money, money that I got by a loan and bought it. And interestingly, it was cheaper than those people who are paying these plots using check of system. Mine was even cheaper. I got a plot. But there was still another hurdle. How do you build? Challenges kibao mutiangu. Maze kuna wakati fundi on site. Mujia, the way I have built, I didn't use a contractor where we do an agreement, stuff like that. It's just been hand to mouth where you get uh, an architect to draw the house. You sit together and decide and then it's drawn. And you will randomly get specialists doing special things. Yeah? I have ended up changing so many fundies. Quark fundies are on the loose out here. Someone will tell you, I do very good plaster. Maze, akikuja kuchapa plaster, ni matope baze. So the thing is, fundies will never tell you the real thing. But I would advise anybody who wants to travel my journey, let Fundi show you what they have done. Don't trust them. Because they always tell you they can do this. But when you give them a chance, you just find they do rubbish. So, some of the challenges were getting Fundis that were not good at what they said they would do. Occasionally, some of them are fraudulent. At one point, I came on my site. I had asked on phone, how many Fundis today? Ananiambia, leo tuko mafundi waine na watu wa mukono nane. We do calculation because I used to do per day most of the time. When I came to site, do you know what I found out? <laughs> Amazing. That day the guy was just curing. That's the word, curing. So they were just doing curing. The guy was on another site. So you end up losing a lot because you are not on site. That was challenge number one. So we talked about quack fundis who say they will do something and they don't know it. Fraud, number two, you will be subjected. Utagongwa kugongwa maze, yeah? Kugongwa niligongwa. So I would advise probably if you have to go this way, you have to really be hands-on, be available most of the time. So one thing that I later on did was to get someone to manage for me. So I put up a site house, had someone to stay on the ground where he will be my eyes. So he will tell me on the side that there are this number of fundis, this number of watuamukono. So when I pay, I pay the real thing. And I didn't wait for it to 
go for a long period because you'll still be double crossed. The same person who is reporting with, to you will still again do third party fraud. <laughs> so what the real thing that you can actually do is to come on the ground. So for me, I've got, immediately they did part of the house. I started living in one room while I'm making another one. Then I can be seeing, so nobody tells me anything that is not right because I'm on site. And by so doing, don't think that you're bright. Because the thing is, also there are some challenges. When you move from one room to another, chances are cement will spoil some of your household items. You will have a broken chair, a broken table, simply because of moving from one room to the other. So challenges are always there. If you have money, you rather just construct and then move in. But the problem with that is that you need to have very deep pockets. If you have deep pockets, fine, construct, finish the house and move in. But you have to follow my path where you are using a shoestring budget, live in and just be creative on how you'll be moving from one room to the other so that you don't do so many breakages of your household items and also the issue of that. Also, if you have small children, there are challenges of children and probably getting sick because of the dust, the cold and stuff like that. But you tell me where in this world that there are no challenges. If you anything, those challenges will inspire you. Oh yes. Property ownership comes with a wealth of valuable lessons. Would you wish to share your experience on this platform and encourage the next homeowner? Simply get in touch and we'll gladly chat. Our upcoming signature bus tour is bigger and better. Don't miss an opportunity to connect with professionals. Mingle with those embarking on their property journey. And while at it, enjoy a day filled with some fun. Book your spot today. The property news segment focuses on discussions and events shaping the real estate scene. you planning an event and are interested on being featured on this platform we are happy to plug in and amplify your event just give us a call and lock our calendars when securing your first property do not be in haste be an informed buyer let me take you through a useful checklist you can work with First, save a deposit. This gives you the option of smaller monthly repayments. Secondly, location, location, location. It's important before making any decision to look for a neighborhood that meets your family needs. It helps to think long term. And if you're planning for a family, consider more rooms, access to healthcare, malls, and recreational facilities. Thirdly, factor in all expenses, including hidden charges and recurrent costs of security, water, electricity, and garbage collection expenses. Get professional help before signing the dotted line to make sure you have ticked all the boxes. Here on The Property Show and First Avenue, our real estate arm, we offer a comprehensive range of services covering the entire property spectrum. The journey to owning a home begins right here and our commitment to you is peace of mind.
Thank you for watching The Property Show. Make an appointment with me every Sunday for fresh insights on this dynamic sector. My shoot location is our very own The Property Show and First Avenue offices. Let's connect on our digital platforms and for exclusive weekly property updates, hit our YouTube channel subscription button. Our diaspora desk is also open for a chat and we are just a telephone call away. See you next week. As always, there is something for everyone. Koheri.